Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel today. I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Bookings in your Microsoft Teams app. So let's jump into it. The first thing you want to do is log on to your Microsoft Teams app, and this is the desktop app. Now on the left hand side, you will have a bit of a toolbar and you're going to look for the calendar option. Now, once you're in the calendar option, it's pretty straightforward from here. You're going to go ahead and choose a day that you would like to create this booking. So let's go ahead and let's choose Wednesday the 1st. We're going to go and tap on that block, right? And that block is now in this current time slot. So it's currently 7 p.m. And what you're going to do from here is you can now add a title. So let's just say a booking for a studio shoot. All right. And then you're going to enter names, emails, or phone numbers of participants that are going to be present in this meeting or this booking. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's add an email address over there. You can also, as we just mentioned, add um, phone numbers. And then you can see that there is a date. And currently, that is the date we selected. And this is the current time slot. However, we can, of course, change this altogether. Let's say we're going to make it for 3 p.m. and this is the start time we can now enter the end time now if you want to have it an all-day event you can literally just toggle this on and it'll make it an entire day event however we are going to just make this from 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. and we're going to keep the date the same and it does give you an indication of the amount of time so that's one hour you can have the option to either repeat this and you can see what type of uh, repetition you can have there and then you can add a location where you're going to just say studio and then you have the body part of your message where you can enter in all of the details you can add things that are relevant to your booking or your appointment so on the right hand side you have a few other options we have a lobby feature which is um, in the teams option and you can now go ahead and you can choose who can bypass the lobby so only people who are invited everyone or only you and then who can present we can also choose either everyone or only you and once we are done here we're going to literally go up to the top right hand side and tap on send now what's going to happen is it says meeting created and it says over here um this has been invited and you are going to say copy you can now share this invite to whomever you want additional to the um contacts that we put in there to be part of this booking so once you're done it is literally on your calendar and you can go ahead and you can view it just over there once you click on it you can see all of the details and whoever has been invited will also see this on their microsoft teams interface now if this was helpful you can go ahead and explore our channel we've got tons of microsoft product tutorials to help you we'll see you over there peace out